What is going on guys, my name is Joe and today I'm going to be running through the best possible starting squad for Northern Ireland on FIFA 16. Starting off the team in net, we have the goalkeeper Lee Camp. Then moving from the left centre back all the way to the right, we have Gareth McAuley, Johnny Evans and Craig Cathcart. All the centre backs look fairly decent with 75 physical, 75 physical and 70 physical um, on each card. Uh, 78 defence, 80 defence and then 73 defence, all decent cards for centre backs but the pace seems like it's going to be a bit of a problem with Gareth McAuley only having 42 defence, Johnny Evans only having 70 which is decent but there's a lot faster players out there that can beat them, um, Cathcart with only 66 first. Moving up into the midfield area, in the left mid position we have Chris Brum. Then in the two centre mids, Stephen Davis and Oliver Norwood. And then to finish up the midfield, in right mid we have Niall McGinn. I'm not sure if that's pronounced correctly, but speaking about him, he's got very good pace. If you were to build this team on FIFA, I would suggest using this right wing side, as he's got 83 pace and 74 dribbling and looks like quite a solid 70 rated non-rare silver. Moving into the other part of the midfield, Stephen Davis looks like he could be a very good maestro to hold the team together, passing the ball, keeping the ball, he's got good physical, 74, good passing, 77, good dribbling, 77, and decent pace at 71, all round nice stats and no stat below 61, which is his shot. Chris Brunt on the other side of him, to the left hand side, um, 61 pace, 74 dribbling, 72 shot and 79 passing, nothing really amazing there, but definitely able to get round a player down the left hand side, um, take a shot or two, but definitely I would suggest getting those crosses in with him. Moving on to the other midfielder, Oliver Norwood, looks like a very good solid silver with no stat below 63, all 60 rated it seems, apart from his passing 73. So use him for passing, but don't let him have the ball at his feet too long, and the team should cope very well. And last but not least, the attacking side of this team. In the left wing position, we have Jamie Ward, then the striker position, Kyle Lafferty, and definitely not least, the last position on this team is the right wing, George Best. Carrying on with the trend of going from left to right, Jamie Ward looks like he's got good pace, good dribbling, balls at 76, could get away a shot, but I would suggest maybe just getting down the wing with him, getting a few dribbles and then passing the ball to either Kyle Lafferty or George Best or any other midfield player that makes their way up the pitch. Kyle Lafferty, in my opinion, should have a lot higher stats and I could see an inform coming in the near future as he is an integral part to the real life Northern Ireland side, coping quite well at qualifying for the Euros 2016. He's been scoring a lot of goals for him and if he carries on I can see a few informs coming his way and definitely a card that I'd like to get my hands on. The last position and the best position in my opinion on this team is George Best. The 90 rated right wing Manchester United legend looks like an absolutely beautiful card. 90 pace, 94 dribbling, 89 shot, 81 pace and well not the best defence and physical but he looks like he could be an absolute amazing card in this FIFA. He's one card that I'd love to get my hands on but with the price of him I doubt I will. The only way I could see myself getting him would be on FIFA draft mode but he looks like an absolutely beautiful card to play with and I'll recommend many people watching out for him when you come up against him online. This has been my run through of the Northern Ireland best starting squad for FIFA 16. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have any other comments that you'd like to see, mention the teams below, whether that's international or club level teams, Manchester United, Watford, Belgium, no matter what the team, you name it and I'll build it. Thank you very much for watching. My name's Joe and enjoy your day.